know what that means? If you lie, that means you're going to hit me again. That's a lie because you said you wouldn't hit me. So if you don't hit me, you're going to tell the truth. And if you don't ever hit me, you're still telling the truth. But if you choose to wait a little bit and then you hit me again, you're lying. So if you lie, like I said, I'm never going to let this go. And if you're struggling now, whoo, imagine what happens if I never let go of this. So if you promise not to hit me again, like I explained to you, I will let this go. So do you promise not to hit me? Hello, little buddy. Little man. Little human. Do you promise not to hit me? Do you know what a promise means? What does a promise mean? Exactly, but what does a promise mean to you? Just because you make promises doesn't mean you follow through. It means that you are full of crap. No, that, that's a lie. A lie is full of crap. A promise means you're sincere and you're honest and you're trustworthy and you're responsible. That's what promises entrust. What does a promise mean, little man? Well, do you promise not to hit me? Do you promise not to hit me with this? What does a promise mean? No, let me hear it. What does a promise mean? Then answer the question. What does a promise mean? What does it mean? Then say it! They say it! They say it! Then say it! You don't, you don't have to say the word, just say what it really means. It means responsible. What does a promise mean? It means you're going to be responsible and do what you say you're going to do. That's what a promise helps and trust. So you promise you're not going to hit me, right? All right, I'm trusting you, little man. If you hit me, I'm taking this away from you, okay? And you won't have it the whole entire night unless somebody else gives it to you, all right? So if this hits me because of you, remember, all right, I'm trusting you. One, two, three. It's almost hitting me. It's almost, it's almost hitting me. Oh, that was close. It almost hit me. I almost had to take that away from you forever. <clears throat> that wasn't the point. I'll count that as me accidentally touching. You did not hit me. But you're getting close to it. You, are you trying to get that taken away forever, ever? Forever, ever? You, I don't even think you get the concept of forever quite yet, but okay. I will teach you if you want to learn. I'm, I'm more than patient enough. I don't have to parent you. I'm only being around you for a, a small period of time so I can be more mellow and be this calm. This a big knife. You better be careful. You're the one that's wielding it, not me. It's your knife. It's not my knife. That's not even a knife. It's a knife. It, it is whatever you want it to be, I guess. <laughs> Currently, the pull identifies as a knife. What? Are you trying to hit the lights on? Yeah. <laughs> it looked like your mom was about ready to come out here and she remembered to check something in the kitchen. And now she's in the fridge. Why? No, you don't. You want them. Oh, gotta yeah. take the pull away. Nope, it's, I'm a man of my words. You promised you, promise you wouldn't I touch me with it. You promised. Yes, you did. I was paying attention. I even have video proof. You're a poopy head. I'm an honest poopy head, at least. You can You're say whatever you want about crap. me. I'm honestly full of crap, at least. You're full of crap. I'm honest about it, at least. I told. What did I tell you? We You're went through the lessons, and this is what happens when you do not listen. It's all right. If you, you have your opinions, I have mine. <laughs> I wouldn't call all of them thoughts even, but okay. Even Steven. Bum, 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 even Steven. You are full of nutty cuckoo heads. 
Nancy Kirkland. <laughs> Actually, you're probably not wrong about that, but I'm gonna help your mom get that toad inside. Well, do you know who 